I want to go open up those doors quickly. Or at least one of them. And, uh, you know, see what's behind there, because that's what we do for fun. We open up creepy doors with creepy little gear wheel key things, but I'm just... Oh, I just want to see if there are any more notes. I'm so interested in this person. Who were they? What were they? Why were they running? Why were they looking for absolution? Why were they looking so much for some kind of hope? What did they do? What didn't they do? Sometimes it's not what did somebody do. It's what somebody didn't do. You know what I mean? All right. So the this is so this is torn parchment and it says terrible to sacrifice one's own child with a lie i prayed on perfectly trusting faith but how could i explain my desperation the deep roads wind in deceitful spirals concealing the sigil from casual observance i could not discern its true pattern until i stood in the fade and gazed down upon the vast malevolent engraving its artist remains unknown, but its horrifying intent was all too clear. As was my necessity, I only wish it had not cost you my only child. I could not build the lock barriers that would carve the marks and break the sigil. You alone could save us all, but only by destroying yourself, and I let you do it. Forgive me. The rest of the text is illegible. The lines and swirls forming a disturbing pattern as I've stared at for too long. Wait, terrible to sacrifice one's own child. So first they said that they sacrificed. I wish it only not cost you my only child. And I let you do it. Forgive me. So it's not that they themselves see like that's literally what I just said. It's not necessarily what somebody does, but what somebody doesn't do. They didn't stop them. But why? What was so important about making sure that this was all closed? Or was it opening, closing? This was all closing. They were creating the gates and closing everything. Blood magic of some kind? Maybe? I wish it had not cost you my only child. I could not build the locked barriers that would carve the marks and break the sigil. What is the sigil? What sigil are we breaking? And why did we need barriers that would carve the marks? Are they talking about the markings on the door? Are each of these doors breaking a sigil? I stood in the fade. So, this has to be a mage, right? And it can't be a dwarf. Once again points to being elven. Gazed down upon the vast malevolent engraving. Its artist remains unknown, but its horrifying intent was all too clear. As was my necessity. So it's almost like whatever this malevolent engraving was, was the sigil. They were doing everything that they could to construct the barriers, which might be these doors. And that's what they were doing because they had to stop it. I wonder if that's really what it was. Can you imagine being tasked with that, though? If that's true, can you imagine being tasked with that and then watching your only child die in the process because it had to happen according to you? I mean, we weren't there. I don't know if it did or didn't actually have to happen, but... A lost caravan. It may have been down here for centuries. I wonder if anything's left. Guess I should look around. Oh, looks like there is a gear. I'll take that. Anything else? Uh, there is some stuff. Apparently gold. I'll take that. Um, I'll leave the rest of the stuff though. In case anybody else wants it. For either themselves or if... Somebody wants to let Orzammar know about it at some point. Looks like there's their camp. I wonder if they were protecting themselves from something. Shut the door. Or was that camp from our friend who created the barriers? And why a barrier here? Why lock in this caravan? Can I open this side too? I can. Excellent. This one has no note attached to it, oddly enough. Let's see what we have. What was that noise? Um. Okay. Anybody home? This looks like a little, like, breezeway almost. Is that what you would call it in the home? Like a breezeway? Oh, the 
this just puts us where we had been. Okay. So it's a little bit of a shortcut. Good to know. And somebody's... Dorian, your rune is still there. I mean, it was a lovely rune. You did an excellent job on it. So I'm glad it's still there. Safe. Um, Where are we headed next? Following the torches that I don't know how they got lit, but they're lit. So here we are. We could go that way or we could go this way. I'm going to go this way first because reasons. Remember, creepy caves are my specialty. It seems like these days. Oh, uh, okay. You. Yup. Just spiders. Just spiders. So many spiders. Just somebody get rid of them for me. Because I can't keep. Okay. You know. If I had known that there were going to be so many spiders, I mean, I still would have come and help, of course, but it probably would have been a I heard the hero of Ferelden came down here during the blight. Cardall met the warden, but I never had the pleasure. I'm sorry. Do you often see Grey Wardens? From time to time. They're a good bunch. Tough in a fight. Fearless. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. I need more gears. Okay, so we need more gears for this door, so we'll have to come back. Hopefully we'll find some. Oh, it's another spider. Okay. Oh, sorry. Am I in your way? You got it, Paul. Okay. Dead. Well, that didn't sound good. That sounded awful. Let's be honest. That sounded completely awful. Um... Where does this go? Uh, can I? Um, all right, listen. Don't tell Colin. This is completely stupid of me, but we're doing it anyways. Like, the amount of stupid in this one thing that I'm doing. Oh. Okay, well, let's put a flag here for the Inquisition, and maybe they can connect us over to these other spots. But the amount of stupid in this one thing that I'm about to do. Okay. Oh! Okay, good. Can I go in here? No? Oh, come on. Let me in! Is that a mug? That's another dwarven mug. The mug bears the inscription, five minutes here is 15 minutes there. I don't understand. Does anybody else understand it? I don't. That's fine, though. Oh, is that a gear all the way back there? Oh, I hope I can get back. Or maybe there's just a better way to, to do what I just did. Yeah, there's definitely a better way to do what I just did. I wonder if I have enough now to open up that side door. Probably not, but might check anyways. Hi. Oh, oh, you guys just popped up there, huh? Okay, good. We're doing well. Let's head back and then maybe before we do anything else, you know what? Maybe we should just wait for the Inquisition to come down and construct whatever they need to do so we can get safely across just so then that way we don't end up backtracking. Plus, I don't know about the rest of you, but a little bit of a break might not be a bad thing. Well, it looks like the Inquisition came in and did a good job of getting us across. It looks sturdy. Right? It'll be fine. We can easily do that. Just don't look down. That's my one word of advice. Do not look down. It'll be fine. As long as you just, you know, don't realize that you could easily plummet to the bottom and, you know, never make it back to Skyhold. Pleasant thoughts, Riley. Pleasant thoughts. Let's see. What is up here? That statue is massive, though. Wonder what it's... Uh, look at that! It's an entire town, it almost looks like. Can we go there? Probably not. Also, does anybody see all that fire over there? That... Mm -mm, that doesn't look good at all. And we're going to have to go straight through that, aren't we? Because that's our luck in life. You see something like that, most normal people would just turn it around. Not really worry about it. Us? Nah, we just dive right on into the danger. Because reasons. 
All right, I got one of these things. So this is the monument to Hadrian the Deep. This lonely podium is carved from a stone pillar reaching up in the darkness. From the inscription, Paragon Hadrian's remains are entombed here under a massive stone likeness of the legendary dwarf. At this vantage point, it is hard to appreciate the scope of the tribute. No, I mean, it feels very... It was a long walk up here. And I got more artifacts for Orzammar. And this must be Hadrian. All right. Well, good. There we go. We got that done. Go us. Go team. Now. That. Oh, sorry, Varric. I just want to see. That's where we had been. Why did that sound like a dragon of some kind? You know, sometimes I just wonder why. Why does it have to sound like a dragon here in the deep roads? But then again, you know what? Let's add a dragon into the mix. I'm ready. All right, so let's... I want to check one thing, and then we'll uh, we'll head into that creepy cave. And then towards all that fire. Doesn't this kind of look like the area from that Grey Warden map? I think we just found the Grey Warden camp. Did, what did they... Oh, was this it? They left behind their sword. I think that we should, um, you know, make sure that that gets back to the Grey Wardens. I think that would be the, uh, the right thing to do there, you know? Okay, so how do we... Okay, I can... Can I use this ladder to get back up? I'm kind of glad that we found that, though. It shouldn't just have stayed there. We'll return it, and then hopefully... They can be remembered properly. And we'll also hand over the journal. Because I think the Grey Warden should have that information. I don't know if typical Grey Wardens know all of this information that we found. And I need to figure out a way to get down safely. Because safety is the keyword. Also, I feel like I got... An I found enough gears to unlock that other door. So, you know what? Let's get that done. I just, I need to know. I want to know how the story ends. Is there, is that another spider? I thought we murdered all of them. Maybe that's not a, either way though. It was creepy and crawly and it had, uh, okay, bull. I don't think that's a spider, but it's one of those other things that likes to just gang up on us. All right, dead. Excellent. Thank you for saving me. All right, so down here, right? Wasn't it? Another one? No, 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 no. They're everywhere. They're absolutely everywhere. Okay. The door was... This? No. I'm... This is where we had been, right? Isn't that where we killed the... Okay. I... Too close. We gotta go back. This is the other area. I got it confused. Oh. More? How do they just keep sprouting up? Oh, I'm gonna have nightmares about this place. I'm going to have so many nightmares about the caves in this place. I actually don't know what's creepier here. The caves or the, uh, dark spawn. Definitely a mix of the two, though. Okay. Okay, more spiders, though. At least I remembered the spider part correctly. Ugh. Oh, bull, did you just jump like that? I didn't even know you could do that. That was incredible. Okay, down here. Yes! Okay, found the door. All right. Shall we? What is this? It's... Whoa. Just a cave. There's a note, though. Polg's journal. Crumpled page. Isn't this the, um, the person who was on Lyrium? Mother holds me when I sleep. Warm. So warm. Her rhythm flows through my throat, burning until the miners and their fat, cruel hands are distant memory. Polg is memory. I am the sun. The words come in waves. I will drown in them for her. 
who is mother. So once again, maybe it's a Titan. More it's delirium experiments. Looks like his results were inconclusive. Interesting, though, no? And left behind some treasure. Is there anything interesting in here that I might... Just more dwarven artifacts, which I'll leave for... You know, in case Orzammar, while they're here claiming everything else, need anything. Alright, so back through here. So that was interesting. He still... With Mother. And what, did we determine that Mother might be a Titan, maybe? Or just the lyrium sickness or the stone? Like the way the stone is talking to him, the way that dwarves have stone sense? He said that Kolg was a distant memory and just the sun remained. Like he forgot who he was entirely. Is that what lyrium sickness does to you? Is that what the blight? I mean, isn't that kind of what the blight does to you, though? It takes away everything that you are until you forget who you had been? Are we literally reading the journal of somebody turning into some kind of weird form of darkspawn? Because that's kind of what it sounds like. Oh, okay, great. Another one of these. Shall we? Yeah, you know, I just... Just to be safe. Let's do this. Enjoy! It's a gift! I know, it's awesome, right? Nobody ends up really liking this gift even when I give it, though, and it hurts my feelings. I work so hard on making sure that you all can have nice trips to the Fade. Thank you! Come on, you screech something awful! Mm -mm, I don't like their screeching. You know what their screeching kind of reminds me of? What is it, though? You know, the, the demon with the long legs and everything and they're screeching? Ugh. Mm -mm. I hate that screeching. Here to my sleep. All right, so down here? Volta, I think that this is where you wanted me to head, right? Oh! So what is the stone saying to you now? Anything? Because if the stone had some guidance here, that might not be a bad thing. Because so far it's been a whole bunch of just dark spawn and... You know, creepy things. Oh, this is a pathway with more gears. Have we seen these gears before? Oh boy. We ready for this? Hello, it's like a welcoming party of Darkspawn. I always wanted to be welcomed by a party of Darkspawn. Darkspawn I really are getting worse. Must be close to a nest. A what? That explains the stench. A what? You called it a nest? Darkspawns have nests? Like a bird? Okay. Well, the things you learn about Darkspawn while you're down in the deep roads, they have nests, apparently. Okay, so this is another door. I doubt I have enough for this one. Now, what's down here? Will this bring me back to where I would have been? Oh, I will take that. So, yeah, this is where we came down from, right? I think that... Is that the last one? Almost? Nope, I think this is my last one. Okay. Probably need to uh, use those gears to open up that door. I assume that that's the way forward. Because it doesn't look like there's any other way to get to wherever it is we need to go. No note this time again? Are they all out of... Maybe that last note was the last one. Guys! Guys! What did we just stumble into? Oh, I hate these things. I do. I do hate it all. It's fine. Here, take barriers. Everybody take a barrier. We just need to make sure we use this to get through it nice and easy. It'll be fine. This is easy. We've done worse. Trust me. Remember, Crypius. It really wasn't that bad, though. Okay. Well, you probably need extra barrier. I just would like you to be safe. Those things look awful. Okay. 
He's dead. Almost there. Nope, there's still... Oh, Dorian, that was such a good placement on that mine. You see that? He stepped right into it. Boom, dead. Oof. Love it when you do that. And... Oh, I got one of those guys. Come, nope, not... Nope. Careful. Anybody got a barrier put up on... Dorian, you just barrier bull. Don't let them get behind us. I wasn't going to. All right. What's next? 